Silence, a poem by Ralph. That's me. Silence, hear the nothingness. Listen to the quietness of everlasting space. Down the widening velvet corridors of time, it sweeps and sweeps and, sw and sweeps away the sound of creatures crying in the night. Creatures crying in the night. And cry we must, for we have tasted the forbidden fruit. But lo, the faceless names and nameless faces whisper of our woes. But over all the blessed silence falls, sweet serpentines of silence singing their sad song. <laughs> um. Out of silence and dark, we built music, silent music. And then the endless emptiness of emptiness is drumming in our ears. Will you all get out of here? <laughs> but in, in the end, all is silence. Quiet, silent always, all still. Oh, could you hold it down, Rolf? We're trying to do a show here. And oh, what the heck's going on with these faces? <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, uh, The Butterfly. I titled this original poem, The Butterfly. Uh, a hymn. I saw a butterfly one beautiful morning flitting silently on the dew-covered lawn. And I thought to myself, how wonderful it would be if we could see millions of these covering the mountains and the plains and the seas. I held out my hand and I motioned to the land. And as I did it, looked for another butterfly with which to mate it. I couldn't find one, so I sat down and I ate it. <laughs> it was only a joke. Funny did laugh. <laughs> Ha! <laughs> bon Scott! <laughs>